There's Faz. <laughs> and John. And my girls. Hi, baby. Hey, baby. Are you videotaping it? And the Jill. Hey, baby girl. How are you? Nope. How's your day so far? Do you remember Mr. Dad? What did you guys do? One show? Chris, no, Chris is over here waving at him. Oh, you got ready to go at lunch after your show? What show did you watch? The snake show? In the cove is Camp Storm. So if you'd like to go down there and look at that, it's open until 1.30. Remember, too, that the breakout session's upstairs. So Tori's pointing them, too. All right. So on the last table down here where Jack is standing are those questions that are on there. So if you need the questions... Hey! It's Marcus again. Are you actually recording? Why not? Oh, you are. Nice. Classic Marcus. You want to take over from here on that? Drinking coffee. Classic. Classic. Apparent classic. Back to work we go. You know what? Let's fix this. There we go. Classic Marcus. Ah! Oh, man. Quite a bit of water. I'm assuming this was just today. Yeah. And we know where the leak is. So, well, yeah, we know what the, the leak is. Right, but this the is coming up from The leak is coming from right here. Uh, uh -huh. The drain that it's trying to go down is clogged. Uh, do we have a tool box? No, we can go get one. Do we have one in the truck? I do. See? Typical day. You start doing one job, get pulled to the next. Before you know it, you're lost. Four days have gone by. You're in a different country. Speaking a different language, I have no clue what I'm saying. But this is all pretty normal. Oh, it looks like there's a leak in the PVC um, in the laundry room of our dining hall. We don't necessarily want to replace that one small portion that's maybe possibly cracked or the seal is undone, only because, as Doug was saying, it's going to be more work for what it's worth we'd rather just replace the entire thing but because of that we now have a clog in the system as well and that's what you saw on the floor so we got to go fix that but in order to fix that i need to go get a tool bag in order for me to get a tool bag i gotta walk all the way out here where cameron parked I assume right now we're just taking care of the clog by jetting it? Yeah. This doesn't let water come through it until this is blown up like a balloon and has pressure on it and then it lets it flow through. Huh. So you can put it in a drain like this, turn on the water. Plug the drain from letting water come back out this way. Exactly. Oh, nice, man. Get yourself a decent little shot for a small space here. Yeah. This is yeah. awesome. I don't know if that's the toilet. The toilet's are right there. Yeah. So, so right now we're so diagnosing an issue, a leak, something start leaking there. similar to and the one that we just fixed in one of the camp houses. Is the toilet loose upstairs, though? Is it I don't at think all? so. I'll go check. Yeah. What's it going? <laughs> <laughs> it's about the reaction everybody else gave. This is awesome, man. It's a lot bigger on the inside than I thought on the outside. It helps when you have a basement. Yeah, that's exactly what does it. House. So that's the tank okay. we were dealing with. Yeah. Check that Schrader valve there. Uh, that's what you were talking about. So this is what Doug was talking about before. Oh gosh. Oh, all right. 
Oh, okay. It's below. And this, that means this is completely filled with water. Where at about this point, maybe, from there up, it should all be air. Okay. And I'm guessing that it probably should have a bladder in there, so the bladder's ruptured. Sure. And it has filled it with water. Okay. What will help for a little while mm -hmm. is if we can get the air compressor with just like a tire valve on yep. it. Okay. And we need to turn some water on someplace, and I want to blow a bunch of air in here. Okay. We'll take this tank out and replace this tank with a new one. And because of the way this sits in here, you see where our height is at? Yeah. And where our pipe comes in, the pipe comes in like that on the bottom of all of them. So I want to find a pressure tank the same size. Hopefully we won't have to make any cuts. The insulation has to come off this side and we have to see what kind of joints we have. Okay. We might have to make a cut on this side. Okay. We shall see. Again, this is just another day in the life of maintenance. Assume that mumbling was to the camera <laughs> and not about you. So our next project is pairing our pass load pneumatic air gun part. I've never done this before, but what could be so difficult? The dish room sink? Yeah, the drains. The drain has come loose and has created a tribute. Can you repeat that again, Rogers? Are you near the office phone or the shop phone? Yep. Yeah. Hey, hello. Okay. It's a tripping hazard right now. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right, sounds good. Yep, bye. Another project. <laughs>